Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome to another video. In today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you all one of the most awaited videos that is my review on the Cosrx Snail Kit. This is their All About Snail Kit for dry skin and dark spot, which is a four step kit that you can find on Amazon, Nike, Flipkart, a lot of platforms. Okay, and it's like a quick, you know, travel come trial kit that you can see if this snail variant, which is overhyped so much, worth it or not uh, so i have actually used the cosrx snail mucin the complete big bottle and i've kind of given you guys a little hint that i really like it but i really wanted to try this complete kit and share with you guys my honest review and you guys enjoy my reviews a lot i do not get into a lot of depths on ingredients and all i'm just like your regular buyer i do not want to get into those things nor am i qualified to talk about ingredients i just try products i tell you a little brief about them and share it with you guys if i will be purchasing them or not or do i like them or not so now without further ado let's get started this kit is actually not that affordable it's pretty expensive it retails for around 1600 okay yeah it retails for 2050 rupees but i got it for 1600 on amazon um i would suggest you guys to not buy it for 2050 wait for the sale and get, get it on a discount so yeah 2000 for a very mini kit is not worth it but you can try it out so yeah, this is the kit. Actually, it's good also in a way because you get to try out the very much hyped products. And this is how those four products come in. They're like legit tiny ones. I really like the clean aesthetic that they have going on. And the reason why I actually in particular got this kit, even though I'd already tried the snail mucin, is because I really wanted to try out the cleanser. And everywhere the cleanser was out of stock. I watch Mandavi Singh's video a lot and she recommends this so much. So I wanted to try it out. So I decided to purchase this kit. So let us start off with the... Cosrx Advanced Nail Mucin Gel Cleanser. This is one of their recent launches. Now, okay, the cleanser comes in this very little tiny bottle. It's a 20 ml bottle. I use this entire skincare routine together as my morning routine till the time I didn't finish out this product. Okay, the cleanser smells like nothing, uh, but honestly, okay, I do not know why the cleanser literally is like 90% of glycerin. I could only smell like glycerin from it. And if I like kind of see the ingredients also over here, it somewhat feels like, you know, it's got a lot of glycerin in it, yes. So yeah, I mean, if I just wanna cleanse my face with glycerin and some little snail mucin added in it, I would rather make it at home. Um, I, I do not know why people have hyped this cleanser so much. I personally would not purchase this cleanser. I didn't like this cleanser at all. It's just a generic cleanser. Yeah, it is something that will mildly cleanse your face as a second cleanser, not even as a double cleanser or a first step cleanser. It'll mildly cleanse your face, but I did not like it. It's a gel-like cleanser, but smells like glycerin. So yeah, and also I do not even think that you're gonna get any snail mucin benefits from a cleanser. So I'd rather suggest you guys to get the Cosrx low pH cleanser, which is affordable and good in quantity than their snail mucin cleanser. So skip on the cleanser guys. So it's a clear based mucin gel cleanser. Of course, smells literally like straight up glycerin. I know these, um, you know, items are fragrance free, but I would any time prefer my Dermaco cleansers over this one. It's just overhyped, not really do anything good to your skin, so skip it. Next up, post cleanser is the Snail Mucin Essence. And surprisingly, okay, this is a 30 ml essence, but this one I still have a little bit left because I could not finish it together with all the others. You actually need a very less amount of the Mucin uh, Power Essence. I've used the big bottle of it, you would have seen on my last month's empty. I love this product. It's a good, you know, uh, kind of like a hybrid of toner cum serum that you can use especially if you've got dry skin and I really really like it I would recommend you guys to try this one out it would not give you some extraordinary benefits because I've used it for like three months now with the previous bigger size bottle uh, it will hydrate your skin for sure and it's a very neutral ingredient so you can use it with your retinols or actives as well not an issue I like it you can use it but it's not going to give you like 
some elixir sort of an effect it's it's a good hydrating basic product but yeah i like it and i will repurchase this one i really like this product it's slimy the consistency is so fun to use it's got anti-aging properties pigmentation reduction properties collagen production but it's a very slow time consuming process if you use it for two three years then only you can see a noticeable difference yes now coming to the other two items in here then we've got the advanced nail peptide eye cream this i i don't even know why do they have it it did nothing to my eyes uh, peptides are actually supposed to hydrate it and kind of lift up your under eye area. I didn't notice anything. It was just an added on step. Would not recommend. I mean, there's nothing that I want to speak about this. Honestly, skip on this eye cream. It's got peptides. It's got snail mucin, but really not that effective. I mean, you can just use the essence on your eyes, like under eyes. That's all. Now coming to my final product, which is there in the kit, which is the Cosrx Advanced Nail 92 All-in-One Cream. This cream comes in a tub if you buy the bigger one, and I've heard so many people talking about it. Now, I have a lot to say about this cream. First of all, I feel like the cream and the essence does the same thing. I did not notice any difference from the cream and essence. It's just that they've mixed this essence in a regular hydrating cream and made this all-in-one cream. Yeah, that's what I feel. So if you want to save some money, you can buy the big bottle of the snail essence. Use half bottle as an essence and then mix the half bottle with like aloe vera or some basic cream and you will have your all-in-one cream. That's what I feel. So it's a hydrating moisturizer, yes, but I didn't find anything extraordinary. I mean, see, I would suggest you guys to either go for this or this, either of them. Do not buy both of them. I would suggest go for the essence only because you can actually make it into a cream. You can't make this into an essence. And I would anytime prefer my Clinique Moisture Surge over this one because the tub also retails for like 1600 rupees. So I wouldn't be spending my 1600 on that tub. I'd rather spend more on my Clinique Moisture Surge even though it's again a basic moisturizer. Talking about the snail benefits, ideally snail mucin has a lot of benefits even in your anti-aging part. But I think that is when you use this products continuously for a year or more, then only you can see the difference. Otherwise, you cannot. And I personally feel the range is a little overhyped, but you can just go for the most hyped product, which is Essence. That's all. You do not need all of this, nor you need this cream. So yeah, the cream, I do not know why it is hyped so much. It's a nice cream. It's a hydrating cream. There's nothing bad, but there's nothing good also about this cream. Like, like I told you, it's just the essence mixed with the regular cream and you've got the Cosrx all-in-one cream. So this mucin cream is good. I'm not saying it's bad. It's hydrating. It's got the mucin benefits, but you can either choose the essence or this cream. You don't need to have both. Plus, I feel like kojic acid would do a better job in helping you with the benefits that the snail mucin does. So choose wisely. So guys, this was my quick review on these products. Uh, I hope you guys liked it and found it helpful. Like, trust me, few of them are overhyped. Just go for the basic one and you will be sorted. So yeah, this was the video, guys. I hope you all liked it. If you do, then make sure you give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye-bye.